Hi guys, welcome to Organic Health Nut and Dairy Gluten Free Keto. My music in the background, which I love to have when I'm cooking something because it motivates me more and it makes me really excited and it, I get all these creativities in my mind just flowing on what to make for dinner, lunch, breakfast, um, shakes, whatever it may be, okay? So this is where I get my, my um, energy from, okay? So today I'm gonna uh, make high fat, low carb to no carb almost. Um, egg dish okay so before I get started I got this amazing um, pack of organic non GMO um, nitrate free gluten free phosphate free um, pork slices and from Costco actually and um, it looks so damn good and I'm so excited to try it well I did try it already and that's why I loved it so much. I'm like, I'm gonna post it. Sorry if this t is a long minute kind of thing to, for you guys to watch, but it's so worth it, okay? I have my organic parsley. I have my homemade ghee butter. You could use coconut oil if you like, or avocado oil, whatever you prefer. I got my avocado here. I got my amazing beet horseradish fermented onion, garlic, organic eggs. I love this company because the yolk is so dark yellow, meaning that it's so strong, and meaning that it has very strong and high vitamin D, which we all need in our bodies. And, um, oh, uh, last, my amazing, my amazing, my amazing, um, steamed veggies so what I do it's almost done because <laughs> I finished it but what I normally do is I take raw veggies like broccoli cauliflower uh, carrots whatnot and I just basically um, steam it I cut them and I steam them and then it lasts for like over a week in the fridge you don't even have to worry about anything uh, however much you want if you're making some sort of dish you just take as much as you like and you um, season it stir fry it you can eat it like that raw whatever you like so that's my broccoli and cauliflower left over um so we're gonna cut everything and we're gonna get started okay so very first thing i'm gonna cut is my onion okay as you can see i'm gonna push this a little bit more here okay so you don't need to use all of the onion um it totally depends on you you could use all of it or you don't need to use all of it, whatever you like. Um, obviously, onions have obviously onions have high, um, there's carbs in onions, so you wanna be careful with onions, okay? So make sure you don't have a lot of that. Um, so I basically, and this is very fast, guys, okay? So uh, just bear with me, watch it. It's totally worth it, as I said. Very high fat, low carb, okay? So I have my onion, I'm gonna, gonna put it in my, pan here okay that's done now my garlic so you can use as much as garlic as you like I love garlic personally so I'm going to go crazy with garlic and I'm gonna use um well right now because this is like very quickly I'm doing this for you guys just so it inspires you and you know you could easily make uh, this at home you know if you're in a rush and there's nothing for you to make or if you get bored of anything else and I'm pretty sure everybody has these ingredients in their home anyways, in their household. So this is very, very quick, guys, okay? Let's do it. My garlic guys put it inside my homemade ghee butter it smells golden guys this is how ghee butter should be should look like actually because this ghee butter I make it myself at home and it's grass fed okay so you're gonna be shocked the amount of ghee butter I put inside big chunk goes right in there and I'm gonna move the camera later 
into the pan so I show you what's happening. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut up my veggies. So I just pick and choose what I want and how much I want of it. Personally, I'm not counting the carbs in this because I'm just doing it by eye because I know what my body needs now. Once you're in ketosis, you don't want to eat a lot anyways because you're already full and you already feel great. So you're you're just reading to what your body really wants to however much you want to eat, how much your body wants pretty much, okay? So very easy, guys, okay? We're going to do this together. I'm going to help you guys in every single way as possible as I can. Um, this is a very healthy dish and it's gonna smell so damn good. You're gonna want to make it right now Literally, okay, as I said, I'm not counting how much I'm putting inside Knowing me. I never measure anything. <laughs> I just basically I make it I Eat it. I eat I eat it and I feel great. I don't push myself I only eat enough that my body wants I don't I don't eat more than what my body does not pretty much want, can't handle, right? So, so I'm putting everything in here, okay? Yummy, yummy in my tummy. Okay, so I'm gonna stir fry this for a bit. So I'm gonna move this right over here, just so you guys can see it. Ah, ah, okay, perfect. Okay, let's do this, guys. Okay. Excuse me guys, I'm sorry. I'm gonna move my camera. I want you guys to see exactly how I'm doing this. Cause I want you to do the exact same thing. Whoop! There we go. Closer, closer. Is that close for you guys? Perfect. All right, so I have my, I have my amazing ghee butter. I have my amazing ghee butter guys, right in there. That's melting through. So am I gonna add any salt in here, pepper, um, garlic powder? Absolutely, so I add my salt. Don't add too much, right? So, I add my no salt seasoning in here, guys. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. So I want this to fry up a little bit, okay? So I'm not gonna have this like, I'm not gonna make it like a tender, but I am going to make it crispy. Wow. Holy moly, it smells great. Okay, so let that cook through a little bit with my ghee butter. That's melting too. Then I'm gonna cut up my amazing um, pork slices. Okay, my delicious grass fed, oh, can't even open it. Grass fed organic. Oh, there we go. Pork slices. Okay. Bear with me, guys. This is almost done. Okay. So how many pork slices am I doing? I'm doing literally two pork slices because it's already high in protein and you don't want to like overdo your protein. So I want to overdo my fat and not really my protein. Okay. So just remember that. So... I have my two pork slices. I have them ready. So I'm not gonna cut them yet. Okay. This is almost done. So as you can see, it's already, it's getting crispy. It's changing color. It's looking great. There we go. There. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to 
I have my parsley ready. I have my horseradish, my beet horseradish. And this stuff is so great. And even though it's beet horseradish, because it's fermented, zero carbohydrates, zero fiber, zero sugar. And it's by Bubbies. Bubbies. Okay. So. So I got my my garlic, my broccoli, a little bit of cauliflower, onions. Um, I got my spice in there with my ghee butter. And yet again, when you're dairy free, you can have ghee if you can tolerate it. That's the only thing that I have, guys. I don't consume anything that's dairy, but ghee butter is something totally different from dairy, okay? So I'm gonna put in my and I'll explain that for you guys if you need explanation. But this here is my awesome pork slices. Okay. Two more minutes, five, about five more minutes and it's done. So. Now I could have easily done this personally with, uh, with avocado. With avocado um oil or coconut oil i could have done it with coconut oil but and i put more fat inside so i put even more ghee butter so i pretty much put about four tablespoons of ghee butter wow this smells great so i have my lemon so don't forget about the lemon guys So the lemon you can put right after if you like, but I like to put it in now. Not too much, very little. Okay, now I'm going to add my beetroot radish. Okay, so I'm, I'm I can be generous and add a lot of this, but personally, um, you can if you want to, but it's very, it's very hot. Um, I like to add only a little bit of it in my, in my egg. So, so I'm going to lower this temperature right now. And the only reason I'm going to lower this temperature is because I am going to put in my eggs. So as I said, because there's a lot of protein already in the pork, you don't want to add too many eggs. You want to add more, uh, less protein and more fat. So I'm just going to add two eggs. Now look at the color as I crack this, guys. Look how dark yellow this egg is. Look at that. It's so dark. Dark, dark, dark yellow. I'm going to add two of my eggs in there. Okay. Now never cook the eggs all the way through. Okay, um, so I just add a little bit of salt on the eggs. There we go. Okay, just mix it up. Isn't that making you guys hungry? I am starving. So excited to eat this. Okay. Now, I'm going to lower this temperature even more now on 300. Look at that. That's great. Okay. Now I got my last, last thing, my avocado. I like my fats. I'm going to add a lot of fat as possible. So, I add my avocado right in there. I'm not shy with this. I cut it up. I open it up. I throw it in more than half of one I like um you can add, oh sorry you can only add you can add half of one if you like but I like to add the whole avocado because I love my fats and that's how I lose my weight and that's how I feel great and full and energetic all of the above right goes in there so this is done I turn it off mix it up 
and then I have some parsley. I'm gonna take my parsley now. And I'm gonna cut up my parsley just randomly with the root, the root and the leaf because the root has a lot of strength and vitamins that's in there. So when you cut up your parsley, guys, don't throw out the stem of it. You want to be able to use that stem, that root, okay? Cut it up. Bam! Throw it in. All right. And then, my last, last thing, you can add your olive oil on top of your ghee butter just to make it shiny. Perfect. So I'm just gonna place it for you guys in the plate. Just so you see how this, how this looks so beautifully. Look at that. Nice, right? So I have I have my beautiful avocado, high fat, as I said, high fat guys, low carb, high fat. Let me have a little taste before I present it. Oh man. And then I just add a, citrus, a little bit of lemon. There we go. And last thing I like to add is more of my spice. There we go. That's the dish, guys. Plain and simple. Okay? High fat, low carb. I did it within 17 minutes, guys. Two eggs, onions, garlic, parsley, avocados, ghee butter. If you don't want to use ghee butter, you can use coconut oil. You can use MCT oil. You can use avocado oil. You can use olive oil. Whatever you prefer, okay? Um, I used uh, two pork slices, which is organic, non-GMO. It's actually the cleanest source of pork slices. Um, and I don't eat it with any bread, nothing at all. I eat it just like that. And this actually keeps me full throughout the entire day. And on top of this, I drink a really nice lemon and lime water. Anyways, please follow us on Dairy Green Free Keto and Organic Health Nut. And go on YouTube and sus sus subscribe Sorry, to my channel. Um, just so I could... Um, present more amazing recipes like this to you guys and um yeah so if you have any questions or concerns please comment below and that looks great i'm gonna enjoy this bad boy now okay thanks so much guys